Hello everyone, it's me ASMR welcoming you to my new logo design tutorial and today I'll show you the little logo Y design. So let's start the tutorial. If you are new in my channel, please do subscribe and hit the bell icon for the new notifications. At first going to the file and taking new options, take an artboard and giving the name Y logo and hit the create button. RGB color mode just because of the web purpose, CMYK color mode for the printing purpose and hit the create button. You'll get the blank artboard. And after that going to the polygonal tool and write down here three the triangle will appear turn off the fill color only the stroke color will appear over here before we start the full process i'll show you here the options that is the essential classic that is the workplace i'm using the essential classic uh, if you are creating this one or using this one and you can reset the essential classic it will as like me and it will reset okay after that and going to the view options smart guide and the snap to point these two points are selected and rest of the thing is non selected okay that's good press the alter option button and drag it and when it is intersect that means you are getting the copy of there in a mac you will press the option button and in a windows you will press the alter button okay press ctrl or command d it will repeat again and again that's good select all the stops press the alter option button and drag it when it is middle it will show you intersect and leave it and after that just reverse this one after making this reverse select all the stops again and press alter option button drag it out press the shift it will help you out to make it properly aligned okay that's fine now again just flip it okay after that drag and just select once or just drag and leave this one by pressing alter option button and now repeat this one so after repeating that you will get lots of uh, triangles in one organized way select all the things and then here is the shape builder tool you can use that shape builder tool by uh, using here you can make this one for the shape to join each other now i'll make it fill color and writing the y over here so this one is y you can merge it out okay making it bigger actually it will help you out or help us out to make this one properly okay after that here is the magic one tool select once line will select and delete all the stuffs so making this and turn off the fill color and the stroke color only making this one 20 pt from the stroke portion i'm just cutting this area so i'll join this one and uh, here going to the pen tool cut off over here here and here and cut over here here and here going to the direct selection tool and select one anchor and delete this another anchor and delete this and i'll delete this portion and this area okay fine our y is ready and here go to the pen tool p from the pen tool and you can select this and you can join with this so that's good and press enter and our logo is ready now here the rounded one i'll just making it ag or you can keep it like this or you can make it round whichever do you like please keep this one okay from here going to the select all the stuffs going to the object and expand and hit okay now this one is not a stroke this one is the normal shape select all the stuffs and from here shift m for the shape builders tool and just delete this portion by pressing alter option button and making it one shaped okay now this one is one shape okay our y is ready now going to the ellipse tool drawing ellipse like this okay and making the gradient select the first gradient and select the gradient color into blue and this okay and press g from the keyboard making this like and you can take the darker blue and making the gradient like this 
okay now send it into back just press the command shift and third bracket opening and now i'll make this color into white you can make it bigger and properly middle but into manually not automatically just because of here is two lines so this y is ready for the logo so making this one a little bit smaller or bigger whatever you do like and making it group making it smaller you can change the color so here i could change the color like this and this or this so logo is ready which options do you like or prefer to use finally it's totally up to you you can write down any kind of name over here suppose you can choose this one then go to the text tool write down something and taking font any kind of uh, font like futura font making it a little bit bigger yeah our logo is ready giving the color from here or it could be like this whichever do you like so making it middle of the all stops and middle of the artboard as well so Y logo so hope that you learned a lot from this video if you did please thumbs up and share with your friend and if you have any kind of question query request please do comment on my video comment section until the next video i'm asmr signing out stay safe stay at home give me in your prayers bye bye